Hi, Jen and Casey here. We're on the Cadillac. Welcome to Fusion Pilates Online. And today we're talking about all about articulations in the spine stretch. And the spine stretch exercise, one of the best places to do it is on the Cadillac. So we have the um, roll down bar here, or the tower bar. And Casey's gonna have her hands on the, um, the dowel here and lengthening her arms up. Good, and I want her to find a really tall, neutral pelvis and spine. The knees are a little bit bent. And from here, she's gonna inhale and just shrug the shoulders up into her ears. And on the exhale, shrug the shoulders down, feeling that width in the collarbone. Good, and a few more of these. So this is teaching people right away how to access that lower wing, how to access that mid-back, because that's gonna be really important when she comes into the spine stretch. Good, now holding there, I want her to keep that connection in her mid-back, the arms are gonna stay straight. So on her exhale, she's gonna wheel the front ribs into the back ribs and curl down and bring the bar halfway down. Good, now here she's gonna hold, take another deep inhale, and then on the exhale, deepening that connection below her belly button to finish the curl through. Good, the head comes forward, the knees can bend a little bit here if she needs to. Great. Now, keeping that beautiful opening in the back of the body, I want her to prepare on her inhale, arms stay straight, exhale and start to curl back. So she kind of goes behind herself, deepening the abdominals, the bar comes up, and then she's lengthening all the way from the sacrum through the crown of the head, the shoulders drop down and the knees can bend again. So she finds that tall hinge forward. And let's shrug the shoulders one more time. Exhale, finding that lower wing, collarbone and upper back, nice and wide. On the exhale, she does a seated ab curl. So the front ribs go into the back ribs as the bar comes halfway down. I want her to hold here, inhale, send the breath into the back of the body. Exhale, deepen that scoop right below the belly button to bring her forward. Good, shoulders are staying out of the ears and all the vertebrae are opening, all the discs are opening to the ceiling. Inhale, prepare into the back body. Exhale, rolling back on the sacrum. So this is her letting go action and she really has to control this through her stability muscles and then a nice fluid stacking of the spine. Sitting bones get wider, the shoulder blades drop down. Good, and she's back into her tall position. Let's watch that one more time. Taking a deep inhale, exhale doing her seated ab curl, opening the back of her body like the back of her Ferris wheel, all her ribs lifting up towards the head. Inhale, she reinforces that. Exhale, she's scooping out the deep belly to go a little bit farther into it. And notice how she's really scooping out her curl here. She could collapse, she could bring her head all the way to the mat, but that's not where we're going for this. Take a deep inhale. Exhale, she goes back using her stability muscles to really communicate with the machine and then gently coming up, widening the sitting bones, shoulders drop down the back, and finding that long back once more. Great. <laughs> Thank you for joining us, and we'll see you next time.